everyone. So I was out shopping and looking for a new uh, pan and I was at Kohl's and I noticed they have the Copper Chef. So I decided, you know what, I've seen this on TV. I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to give it a shot. Let's take a look and see what happens with it. We're going to try some eggs and some bologna to see if it sticks. Now, it does come inside with some directions. And in the directions, it does say to use low to medium heat and also not to use a lot of oil, especially extra virgin olive oil because it says that that uh, heats up too much or something, I believe. So don't use any of that stuff. No sprays either, it says. It says to clean it with a mild detergent, of course, don't use anything harsh on it or any hard scrub brushes. And same with when you're cooking. Be sure you don't use any metal uh, spatulas or cooking utensils. Let's get to cooking and see what we can find out. First of all, we want to be sure that our temperature is no more than medium. Uh, my numbers go up to nine and then high, so I'm going to put this around four and a half for the egg, and that should be about right. We'll let it, let it heat up because it does say that it heats uh, evenly. No oil, butter, anything in the pan. Okay, our pan should be uh, warmed up just right, hopefully, heated very evenly. Um, you can see here on the bottom. It has a nice surface, it's not too rough, won't scratch anything, and I can feel that we're warm now. So let's go ahead and put our egg in, see how it does. Hopefully no stick. Seems to be cooking fairly evenly, happy with that. Of course it's not frying because there's no oil or any grease or anything in the pan. It's just a nice cooking so far. Very happy with that. Have my non-stick spatula. Okay, so it's been cooking for uh, maybe a minute and a half. And oh my, oh my gosh, look at that. Not even sticking at all, it's just, it's, it's perfect. I can go all the way around here. Look at that, no sticking anywhere. It's sticking to my spatula. Oh, I love this thing. Look at that. It's sticking to my spatula and not the pan. Unbelievable. I can't even get it off of the spatula. Amazing. Look at that. No stick anywhere. This is going to be ready, I think, to eat. right on your toast, your bread, whatever you want. No stick. That's amazing. Okay, now I'm gonna try a piece of bologna. This is actually uh, turkey bologna, uh, but still. We'll see if it leaves any residue and so forth. You can hear it frying. Oh man, that smells good. Actually turn the stove down to about three and a half, which is kind of medium low, uh, just because it's not an egg. Nothing sticking in here anywhere. I have a couple pieces of the egg in here, but they're just floating around, not even sticking. Look at that. No stick. No stick at all. Look at it sliding around. Look at that. Look at it sliding. There's not one drop of grease in here that I've added. Amazing. I have to give the Copper Chef a thumbs up. I have no affiliation at all with Copper Chef. Uh, I just picked this up at Kohl's and I actually had a coupon. It was regularly $19.99 and my final price was like almost not quite $13. So you can see there I picked it up at Kohl's.
I also want to mention that this does have a lifetime guarantee, it says, um, on the coating of the pan. So this cooking surface is what has a lifetime warranty. Uh, the rest of it, like the handle or the outside, has a 60-day warranty, which, you know, if you're not taking care of it, it's not going to last anyway. But if you take care of it like you should, it's going to last. Here's what the lifetime warranty says.